Hello, my name is Tyler Branham. I'm with the Pikeville Independent School District. I'm a special education teacher at Pikeville High School. Uh, the topic I have uh, for this PAN project is present levels for students with other health impairments. Uh, some current problems of practice that caused me to choose this topic are vague student descriptions in the IEP, specifically in the present levels section that do not include clear specific statements that describe who the student is, what their strengths and weaknesses are, and there's a lack of use of measurable terms, uh, specifically being taking data and putting it into the present levels uh, to allow for better decision making and a greater foundation from which to start uh, the program and plan the program for the student. And also again, a lack of lack of and or depth of information, uh, including data from rating scales, uh, various assessments, uh, medical history, those types of things. And so I just feel like it was a good uh, topic to choose uh, in order to better help our fellow educators create a, a better IEP, a better program for these students with OHI that we can better define who they are and we can lead, uh, lead them to a, a better outcome uh, for their educational career. Uh, my project, uh, I'm going to assist special education teachers in the development of present levels. Uh, and this is, this is going to address three questions. Uh, what, do I, what data do I need? Where does the data come from? How do I find it? And how do I use it in the development of the IEP? I think those are three great questions, especially where really for any, uh, anytime you're determining eligibility uh, for a student with a possible uh, disability, uh, you need good data. You need uh, to be able to fill in the blanks in regards to who the student is, what their strengths are, what their weaknesses are, how they compare to same age peers. And uh, you need to be able to figure out, you need, you need to know where the data comes from. So where do you look? Where do you look for this data? And then how, how to use it. That's the practical application uh, part of it. Uh, this is going to provide special education teachers with a how-to guide in writing a, a good, descriptive, detailed, and specific present levels of academic and functional performance for students with OHI. Also, uh, I hope to uh, generate a checklist for items that is, are needed to effectively uh, write these present levels. Uh, and the anticipated outcome of my, my project is first <clears throat> that we gain better information, uh, data, and uh, all the things that we need in order to fill in the present level. What this does, it's going to back the proposal of the disability diagnosis, diagnosis of OHI. Um, so we hope to, uh, through this project, be able to point the educator uh, to the specific places where the data comes from, what data they need in order so they can have better information to use, which will lead to better present levels. The data we get will help inform decision making for the development of the IEP and the annual goals for that student. Uh, and in turn, that's going to create better IEPs for these students. And this IEP is a program for the student. It's going to lead to better educational outcomes for these students with OHI. And hopefully we'll see some success from it. Also alleviating some stress for the teachers. And that's my project. I look forward to working with KVEC. Uh, and looking forward to seeing uh, the fruit that comes from this project.